Hey guys, welcome back. It's your girl Miriam. Today, me and the Yumi Us team are here with Miss Celebrity Stylist, okay? Miss Denise Brown in the building. Hey. Yes, you already know how we do. Our little fashion segment is going to be wicked today. We're going to have a solid episode for you lot. And yes, look at her. Oh, look at her. I'm oh. excited. Yes, it's going to be a good one, guys. Stay tuned. I'm Denise Brown. I'm a freelance fashion stylist. I've worked with many publications. I've also styled over 30 celebrities, including Kanye West, Rihanna, and Ed Sheeran. So what would be your advice like to get in the working industry after gaining all the academic knowledge? Okay, so what you're gonna have to do is probably internship. So you can either look for a full-time internship job, which pays you, or you can assist um, either a stylist or work for a fashion company. So it could be like either, it could be high-end company or it could be e-commerce. It really depends on what type of stylist you want to be. Um, talking about like advice and everything like that, um, if you were to have advice, not just fashion, but just anyone creatively, what would be your best advice to anyone that wants to get in any type of industry that's creative? My advice is, number one, know what you want. If it's what you really want to do, either you study what you want or you can do an internship of what you want and stick to your guns and always be focused at all times. That's, that's my advice. Just go for it. It's going to be hard. It's not going to be easy. Yeah, you're going to have to be... There's a lot of hurdles that you have to go through. Um, I would say just go for it. And just... If you're not studying it, approach who you want to work for. If there's a certain company go for it if you want to be on tv and you want to work for itv then you need to find out who's in charge of that certain section and approach them so just go for it go for anything that you want to do and don't let no one deter you and stop you when you're a creative person i feel like the hardest job is actually turning up to whatever you've decided to do so how do you win that battle personally my thing is that you have to complete your task yeah, you just got to keep complete and keep on going. You can't stop it. You can't just say, oh, you know what, I'm going to do this. But you know what, I can't be bothered to go and finish this. Let me go and jump on something else. you got to make sure you're, you're, you finish off what, you've, what you're starting. And if you're comfortable and you say, yeah, you know what, I'm, I'm, I'm nice. Now I can start on my next project. And that's what sometimes you have to do. You have to come out your comfort zone. And sometimes, you know, certain people have events. So you might have to show up and talk to them at the end and say, listen, this is who I am. Here's some of my work. You can bring a little booklet. This is not, this is, or you speak to someone in that actual field. Can you help me? That's, that's number one. Can you help me? Sorry, can you mentor me? You see, when you're young, we got this weak spot for the young people then. All the olders, yeah, they got weak spots for you. If they see that you're showing up and they see that you're serious, you'd be surprised. They will bring you in. They say, you know what? I want to help him because I want him to take himself to that next level. And if somebody can see that you're passionate and you're on it, they'll help you. So that's what it is. You've got to speak to someone that is already in that position. And that's what I'm saying. When you're young, you find out who that person is and you holler at them, create your LinkedIn account, say to them, listen, this is who I am. I'm young. I'm on it. I want this. Please give me a chance. And then you'd be surprised. Trust me. So that's what you need to do. Hi, I'm Denise Brown Stylist. I just want to send a shout out to the You Me Us crew. Thank you guys for inspiring and motivating young people from all over and also for motivating me. Thank you guys. <laughs>